Oh! I got one! <laughs> oh my gosh! In the drain? Are you kidding me? In this little drainage ditch, guys. Oh! What is going on, folks? Welcome to the channel. Today we are here with Josh. Say hello, Josh. What's up, guys? What's up? So, <laughs> guys, the comment of the day is popping up. So, remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell and leave a comment down below on this video. So, maybe you'll be in next video's comment of the day. So, it has been raining like all day. So, Josh and I are extremely excited to come out here and go fishing. Normally, after a huge storm, the fishing is really good. So, what we're going to be looking for today is just like drainage pipes, stuff like that, where water is flowing through and see if we cannot find some big old bass maybe even some small bass I don't really care as long as there's fish I am down let's go ahead and start fishing folks oh my guys <laughs> Look at that little chubby boy. First cast. First cast bassin. Do you throw it without the uh without like a skirt on it? Yeah, it's just a jig head. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bye bye. Bye Love buddy. Your dad. Hope you find your dad. <laughs> All right, so we just turned the camera on. Josh has already caught a fish. I'm throwing the speed worm. And I don't even this will be my first cast right here. And Josh has another one. <laughs> All right, I got to get back over to Josh. Whoa! <laughs> wow! Jeez, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> Bye, buddy. Two casts, two bass. Dude, what in the world? Hey, can I borrow what you're throwing? <laughs> oh! Oh! No! <laughs> oh my god. Are you kidding me? Did you see that? Yeah, I did see that. It was, I wasn't even fishing. Are you kidding me? Oh, I got one. <laughs> oh my gosh. In the drain, are you kidding me? In this little drainage ditch, guys. Oh, 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 dude. Oh my God. Oh my gosh, Josh. <laughs> you in the drainage ditch? Guys, so we were headed back up to the truck to actually retie on some different baits. So I decided to throw in this little drainage ditch and caught this absolute massive wow. bass. I maybe thought that I catch like, I don't know, like a bluegill or something in there and then I pulled this thing out. So we're gonna go ahead and let this thing go and back in the drainage ditch. This is insane. Should we let him go on this side? He'll swim through. This side, he'll swim through, all right. All right, here she goes. Oh, look at that big fish. Oh my gosh, there she goes right through the drainage pipe. Dude, that's awesome. Josh is up there. So here's the river, guys. I was so excited to catch that fish. I haven't caught a fish that big in a while. I've been fishing for like a week and fishing's tough right now. So there's this little river that kind of goes down here and then, <laughs> and then there's more on the other side of this road. This is where the other part of the drainage ditch kind of goes out. And then I caught my fish right there on this little drainage ditch. It kind of leads out to a huge lake, but I wasn't expecting to catch a fish of that caliber in this little drainage ditch thing. So Josh and I are about to go ahead to another pond. We're just gonna go, since it's raining, normally when it rains, we try to fish as much moving water as possible. So we're just pond hopping today, baby. So we're going to pond number two now. You ready, Josh? We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna go catch some big fish. Uh, all right, time to go to pond number two, man. Are you excited? I'm super excited, bro. So we got what, three fish there in like 10 minutes? Yes. About, so now we're going to another spot. We're gonna fish there for 10 minutes and then we're going to another <laughs> spot and then we're just gonna keep on rolling until we run out of sunlight. Right here in this? I just wanna see you try it. The bluegill? Yeah, all right. get eaten on that, but like, that's what they eat in here, to be honest. <laughs> hey, weirdo. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, did you see that thing? I saw the flash of it. I saw the belly. That's oh, dude, that was like a seven or eight pounder. Possibly, yeah. 
No, not dude. Did you see that? I didn't see it. He was right here. I've never seen a bass that big hit that close, like that close to me, bank. ever. To the bank, water. to the bank, this shallow water, and like just close, like that thing was massive. And the thing about this swim bait is that like the treble hooks are so weird. They're on the front, They're so, so small. it has I bet to. It was terrible problem. Yeah, I've had like ten bites on this thing, and I've never caught a fish on it just because look at these treble hooks. They're in the front, first of all. A lot of times the bass will come from behind. Well, actually, I guess with the bluegill, they come from the front. That way, that the. It's wrapped around your line. Yeah, <laughs> I don't even. I don't even know what's going on, guys. I was not. Josh was like, "Yeah, just throw it for ten casts, just to mess around." Yeah. So I was. I was. Barely paying attention, just looking at the action in the water. Next thing I know, a like probably a trophy sized largemouth in Florida came up and nailed that thing. I think it was like eight, seven to eight pounds. Easy. I've never seen a fish that big, like this close to the bank, nail a darn blue. I'm so confused. I don't even. I don't even want to talk about it. Oh my, dude. I, dude. I have not seen a bass that big in like a month. Oh, fish. What in the world? Dude! 100%! Dude, 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 dude! The hookup on this thing is awful. I don't want to throw this anymore, bro. Guys, that is two fish on this massive blue... G dude, I, that was probably another massive one. I don't even want to... I'm glad I... I'm surprised I've had two hits on this thing standing in the same spot. And I don't know how big that one was. And I'm glad I didn't see it because I'd probably be crying right now. So I picked the swim bait up again. Looking to dis disappoint myself some more. Ah. Uh, Jeez. Oh, I got one. I got one on the swim bait. Yes. <laughs> dude, I caught one. It's not a monster, dude, but it's big. Oh, my gosh. Dude, <laughs> look at this. Look at that. Oh, that feels so much better after losing that other one. I barely had them hooked, too. Oh, my gosh. Dude, that feels so nice, bro. Look at that. Yes. That's a little skinny boy. Little skinny boy. That's why he was trying to eat the big swim bait. He's like, I'm hungry. Yes, <laughs> I'm a hungry boy. I need some dinner. <laughs> it's dinner time. Oh, Mom brought home Lunchables. Mom brought home Lunchables. <laughs> I don't want to eat leftovers, Mom. Can we please stop at McDonald's? <laughs> we gotta let this girl go. We gotta let her go. <laughs> Dude, this this is freaking. I don't even. Here, Josh, hold it so they get like so they can tell how big it is. It's not really all that big. It's like two and a half pounds, maybe. But that's how big he is. <laughs> Look at us going the extra mile for the army, so you guys can see how big this fish is. I'm telling you, the other fish I had was an absolute stud, but it does feel nice to catch one. We're going to walk as far down as here as we can. All right. Uh, heck. Boop. Later, man. Later, man. All right, guys. It is the next day. Weird transition. I am very sorry. I ended up snapping off my big swim bait, unfortunately. It broke my heart, and then I forgot to record the outro, so we are here another day with Riley. Riley and I are actually about to go film an awesome video. A little sneak peek. Normally, I don't do this, but... We have a chatterbait tied on and a bat. And believe it or not, guys, the bat isn't going to be the craziest thing we're throwing in this next video. I'm super excited because we also are going to be fishing with a massive duck and also the biggest swim bait we can find. We're about to go to the tackle store right now, buy all that stuff for this video. But you guys are going to have to subscribe and also hit the bell so you don't miss it when this video comes up. The bell, I'm running into the rod, <laughs> running into the rods, but the bell will notify you whenever I post a video. I'm going to be trying to post Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Friday now and Sunday as well but if I don't post like Sunday or Monday I'll post like one of those two days so like three to four times a week we're gonna see how it goes I'm gonna try to upload more often for you guys so that'll be awesome but Riley and I are about to go fishing so I'm gonna have to sign out oh one more thing I'm in portrait mode right now on my camera I'm trying out new camera settings so let me know if this looks better to you guys or if I should go back to the other setting if you even notice a difference and I'm also getting a new b-roll lens so the cinematic shots are gonna be very crispy so Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We got to go make more videos, but we'll see you in the next one. Fish bump, I'm out of here.